Today we're at uh, Big Easy's Custom House in uh, Little Falls in Rudaport and we're with uh, Big Easy himself, uh, Johan. And uh, we, they, they're known for their customs on choppers and Harleys and cafe races and the like. But we sit here in front of something different today, you know? We sit here in front of a katana of all things. Yeah. And this, this has to be one of my most... I, I've owned about three of these in my life and I, every time I see it, the one I, I get very cross with myself that I sold it. But this one, I just walked around it. It is really, really special. You guys have really gone to town on this button. Tell me a little bit about it. Yeah, the thing is, we we don't like to touch Japo. We call him Japo Crapo. But uh, <laughs> you know what? They're such legendary bikes. Katana. Yeah. You know, I mean, really, the name just rolls yeah. off the tongue. Katana. Yeah. So we decided, like, well, we'll give it a try. And uh, the bike came to us. It was really sad. And we decided, OK, let's, let's throw it. Let's throw the wall to it, and uh, we went about it. And we've got a stainless steel four into one custom um, Yoshimura header with a custom uh, end piece there at the back. Um, we've got Pixar swing arm at the back with a Vitugo mono shock. Of course, we had to chrome the rims front and back. We did the more modern upside down front suspension. Also, from um, the Jigsaw. Yeah, like. and then the, the custom wave that. So, I mean, yeah. The idea with this bike was to build a concourse level custom katana that really runs. Yeah. So we went ahead and we found really awesome bits and pieces that would go with the lines of the bike. So the decision in using these uh, flickers, they were all from the lines of the bike so yeah. that it, it matches, you know. Yeah. Every single little detail we've paid attention to. We've even got a number plate bracket at the back there that flips up and then you don't see it. You don't see the number plate at all. So when you enter in the concourse competition, there's no yeah. number plate. And um, you just flip it down when you want to use it. This yeah. is one of those bikes you ride to the concourse competition. Yeah. You win the trophy yeah. and you ride it home. Yeah. That's what the, the aim the was. Yeah. The saddle looks stock, but it's not. Yeah. That is actually a marine vinyl that we've used in those colors. Um, when you customize a bike, you want to you want to pay attention to the five genres that judges like to judge on, which would be paintwork. Therefore, we did a custom airbrush on the tag. That is beautiful. What's that? What's that? What's that airbrush called? <laughs> so he calls it the, the owner calls it katana fashion. You know, yes. you know, falling for the fashion of owning one. Um, some mods on the motor. This is brass handcrafted, pickup cover. We did uh, flat slides and we did some custom air intake there as well. It's really throaty. It sounds awesome when you ride it. We we went um, old school modern retro revival in styling. Right. Um, the back tail light has been blacked out, and then we've got a modern LED headlight in, uh, yeah. in the shape of an old mm. uh, headlight. It's know? nice so that they actually, you can actually get those these days. You can actually get awesome. the retro model. Yeah, yeah it's, it's awesome. It's really awesome. Cool. We didn't go crazy on the motor. Um, the motor is still stock except for a few minor tinkering and valve oh, adjustments. Same all make that. Yeah, yeah it, does, it does make a hell of a difference. Look, it's, it's a 1981 motor. It's an 82 frame and some bits and pieces off an 83 and an 84. Right. So it's it's a it's, you could say it's a mixed match, but it came together beautifully. You know, what, 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 what I like about it, it's still recognisable as a '80s katana. That was the whole idea. But you can also stand back and say, okay, it's mono shock. It's got a 180 rear on the front. It's got a 120 17 on the yeah uh, on, the, on, the, on the front and 180 on the rear. Uh, it's got mono the proper mono shock. So the biggest problem with these bikes, I've owned a couple of them, I've owned three of them. And uh, the handling one is not that great, especially with the 19 front and the 18 rear. This the is, these heavy white metal motors, <laughs> they will make you pray. Yeah, for sure. So, yeah. But, but uh, they're, 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 awesome they're, they're strong motors. Yeah, awesome bike. So, we went for black. Yeah. We used the piano black. It's probably the most difficult color to paint. Yeah. 16 coats of piano black to get that depth. Yeah. This um, this gets hit by the UV rays. The black does that. Beautiful. It, it's really an awesome color. It's really beautiful. Yeah. Uh, and then blended into the artwork on top. Of course, yeah. we had to bring in some more brass, so we had to cap brass plate. All oh, right. As yeah. well. I see that. Yeah. We thought that would be a nice 
it kind of yeah. picks up on the gold chain as well. If you look at that, also minuscule. Yeah, you know. That's what I always like about your guys' work is little touches here that you don't notice, and then you say, "Hang on, let's pick that." You know what's awesome about this bike? Yeah. The opinion can go with it. Yeah. So we did a custom bike, but it can handle opinion as well. It can be a day-to-day -day ride as a concourse. It's all in one. Yeah. You know, you, you can park it outside the bar. Yeah. You can take it to a concourse competition. You can take it out to the nearest ride. You can. It's an awesome thing. It's one of those bikes. It's a sleeper. It's not sharp. Yeah. Let me tell you, yeah. it will deliver if you ask it. Um, but it's it's an awesome piece. Um, it's getting delivered tonight. Awesome. The client can't wait a day longer. We don't blame it. We Sighted. don't blame it. We don't blame yeah. it. No, for sure. Look, these bikes have always been legendary. Like I say, I've been a couple of them. And this one, I mean, when I walked in, I just stopped it. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's earned the name in the workshop as the Katana Killer. Yeah. Because you know, it's been a few fingers, even mine. I don't know what it is with this bike. Yeah. I just had it in for our hands. Yeah. But we've done it, and it's beautiful. And uh, we can't wait to be the room. These guys are awesome. Congratulations. Another fantastic job. Thank you. Guys, you got anything motorcycle related that you want done? Uh, not just uh, uh, the, the ones. What's those bikes where we get those flies on the back of your helmets? Oh, uh, really? <laughs> <laughs> you always put a go there. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a big Superbike fan. Jan's a big uh, Harley fan. But yeah, uh, he doesn't only do custom choppers in cafe races and etc. They also do. Uh, Retro, Vintage, retro revival, retro revivals. They also do full restorations. Back Street to fighters, cafe races, full restorations, really vintage bikes. We'll put together. Well, you'll get them to work behind us. And they are the legend. So we did that um, a couple of days. We'll build you a custom chopper. We'll, we'll yeah. modify, convert, change. Yeah. Pull out of one genre into another. Hit here to uh, hit. Uh, what's your Facebook page? Uh, Big Easy Customs website. Big Easy Customs. Instagram. Instagram. Big Easy Customs. TikTok. Big Easy Customs. You want everything there? Go yeah. have a look at some of the work they've done. They post a lot of stuff, and then also come into the shop. The shop is an absolute treasure trove of really, really. I, I come in here. I have to leave my wallet at home because I just want to spend money. They've got men's fragrances which. Sounds a little bit um, interesting, but mint fragrances are great. I mean, it makes us smell a lot better than sweaty, uh, sweaty wampers. It's mint fragrances. Yeah. It's clothing. It's wallets, jewelry. It's accessories. It. You will not find crap in my shop. Yeah. We will sell you only stuff that we think real bikers need. Yeah. And that's about it. Yeah. And yeah. even if you're not a biker and you just want something really cool, you want a cool Christmas gift for that biker in your life. The easiest customs. Thanks. Give us your time. address. Uh, we had shop number eight, upper level, uh, the KTM Raceworks building on the corner of Zandfleet and Hendrik Potkita in the Little Falls area, Riddapwit. Um, we also will deliver, we'll courier, we'll send out to you. You can order online from us. Uh, get onto our Facebook page, you can talk directly to Molly's. She'll sort it out for you. And um, yeah, that's it. No problem. Cool. Yeah. Congratulations. Thanks, yeah. Yeah. And guys, yeah. get yourselves here. Okay, cheers.